So how did um, the post-pandemic and continuing hybrid culture play a role in either adding further to this workforce or has it been a challenge in getting people to come back to the offices? Because, of course, we've been talking about this a lot in the tech space and it's a continuous debate. Yeah. I'm going to say something controversial, which I I'm think... I'm glad. <laughs> no, <laughs> Shad, you leave the controversial no, part to me. No, but look, I think, I, I think, look, the tech industry is one of the most spoiled industries in terms of sort of this this model of how we're working. We're the only industry that's working so uniquely, right? And we were passionately discussing how it's so incredibly important to come back together. And I love what Amit said, and I'm going to steal it. He said, you know, the difference is between having a friend and a Facebook friend, right? And when you're connecting with people continuously, virtually, you're not building the kind of connects. And I'll give you a very simple example from yesterday. You know, I had a customer in town in Bangalore, and I spent an hour and a half over lunch with him. And I had met him in June 2020 for the first time ever, and we met virtually, right? And I have such little memory of him in terms of the persona or that conversation. And I won't forget the conversation from yesterday, right? And that is the difference between the physical and the, the virtual connect, right? A couple of design principles which I deeply believe in. The future of work is hybrid, right? Which means people should have flexibility to work uh, from home, but people should also be coming in to organizations. Uh, the reality is you have to access talent. So we've got to try and go to where talent is as opposed to continuously bringing talent to the big cities, right? So we have to expand in terms of how we access to also make it more inclusive, right? And we've got to appreciate that relationship matters, right? I feel that one of the reasons the virtual model also worked back three years ago is because a lot of people knew each other. But if I just look at the IT services industries, which has added an enormous number of people and have seen high attrition over the last three years, 40, 50, 60 percent of people in the organizations, in terms of physical people, are new to the organization. They've never walked into an office. They've never built a relationship physically with someone in many instances. And you can't build that kind of connectedness and intimacy, I feel, uh, no matter how advanced technology gets. We're human beings, and that doesn't change if you're the chairman of a company or a fre fresher joining from campus. We all emote, and we all need a sense of connectedness. So I'm a big believer we should be coming back in some shape and form and connecting because there's an intimacy to it that is irreplaceable with technology. If you like the video, do like, comment, share, and subscribe.